Okay, here's the first glimpse of uh, <clears throat> the first test of my solars hooked up. Uh, I got 821 watts coming in out of 940. This is the first day the uh, the four panels on the solar tracker have been working. And now clouds are going by. I'm equalizing my batteries. They're outside boiling away. They need it. They need attention bad. I'm going to do a quick walk around outside, so it's probably going to be a little shaky and jumpy. So here we go. Uh, I had 904 watts coming in out of 940 just a few seconds ago. All right, I'm going to go show you outside real quick. This is going to be a down and dirty video. I'm not editing it. I don't have time. I'm bouncing around up and downstairs, walking on rocks, so bear with me. Here's the battery bank, all hooked up. I still have to hook up the fan. The batteries are just boiling away. If calmed down now because I got some uh, clouds going by. There's a shot of the sky. There's a big cloud going by. I didn't get done with this till uh, 7 o'clock last night. Everything you see down here is temporary. As soon as I get the uh, building up, all of this will be moving up to the uh, pad where the house is going to go. That's the solar tracker. Hopefully, I'm catching it. I can't see the screen. I got to tidy up the wires, hook up the ground wire, get that battery box off the ground. That solar panel there is another 250 watts on the truck camper going up to the 500 watts, so 750 watts total. That runs a 12 volt system in the truck camper and it charges the two big L16 batteries on the front of the toy hauler which run the 12 volt system on the toy hauler and the toy hauler camper also has a 24 volt system which is those batteries in the box that go to that Samwix 4000 watt inverter I have inside. Now we're going to go down the side of the pad here and hopefully I don't kill myself. <sighs> Everything is hills and rocks around here. So there it is. That's the first test of it. Here comes the sun. Uh, my solar panels are filthy. I got no water, so I had nowhere to wash them. Hopefully I'll get a well within a week or two. That would be sweet. That's going to run me about $7,000. Hopefully it doesn't cost more than that. So they're finally up and running. Nice feeling to have some electricity coming in. I don't have to rely on the generator. My neighbor came by this morning. I made him a pot of coffee with my electric coffee maker. It's his first solar coffee. He was like, wow, that's cool. I'm like, yeah, I can do whatever you can do. I just needed to get my solar panels up. And it's, uh, it's not too hard living off grid. If you do it upright. Okay, so that's it. I'm going to keep it short and sweet. That's my update. I finally got my solar power up and running and almost living normal life. Alright, that's it for now. More updates to come.